Okay, good morning. God bless everybody. In Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. <clears throat> um, I want to let everybody know, um, last night I was, I felt like I was having some attacks. And I got down on my knees and I prayed. I'm like, Lord, you know, why am I seeing these? Why are these things coming towards me? And, uh, and I said, uh, I count on your power and your might to deliver me from these things. And, uh. I ended up going back to sleep, and when I went back to sleep, it was like I was sitting there with that phone in my hand, and I was scrolling through it, like looking for something to look, to watch somebody, something about the times we're living in, and uh, all of a sudden it turned into like pornography, scrolling like that, this was nothing but filth, filth. And you guys, look at what the whole world is doing. Everybody. Everybody's like this with their phones. I don't care where you go. Go someplace. Go to, like I was at the dealership. Get the oil changed. And I looked at everybody sitting in there waiting for their vehicles. Every single person. Not one of them was not like this with their phones. Not one person was having a conversation with another person. Because they were all like this. Everybody. It's... This is an addiction. And you know what? And Setsu was sitting here saying, you know what? When these end times come, <laughs> you know, we're not going to be deceived. We're not going to be, you know, we're not going to be led away in air with the wicked. Because we're not going to be doing what the world is doing. Well, guess what? The whole world is looking at their phones all the time. They're going through them all the time. And, uh. And I was clearly shown last night, you know, to the Lord, it was just as bad as looking at pornography, filth, okay? God is showing us everything. His word says acknowledge him in everything. I mean, if that doesn't amaze you, man, this is like 24-7, man. All we got to do is see everything that God is doing. These phones are nothing but a distraction. And in <clears throat> and these end times, I do not want to be found looking in these phones like everybody else is in this world. Uh, he clearly made it very clear to me, uh, surfeiting through these things. is like looking at pornography all the time. What everybody does is on their own, okay? I'm not judging anybody. I'm telling you what I was shown. And I do not want to be found staring at videos. Now, I will still have my phone because I'm going to I need it for doctor's appointments and whatnot. And I'll still have an email, okay, where um, I won't have the YouTube channel no more. Okay? I will not have the YouTube channel. But you can clearly see that's my email. Okay? As long as everybody's got some decent things to say, I will respond. Anybody wanting to come at me with any negative or filthy stuff, filthy talking or anything like that, I won't respond to you whatsoever. And I'll just block you. Okay, you guys. This I just wanted to give everybody a heads up because people are going to say, whatever happened to him? What happened to him? What happened to him? Nothing. The only thing is, is I'm... I'm getting my eyes, uh, I'm just focusing on everything that the Lord is doing, and I'm listening to my scriptures, reading scripture, um, I'm done with it, you guys, we're right at the very end, man, I was showing everything's getting ready to start washing away, and it's right there in plain sight, God's doing it, okay, um, I'm not going to be found doing what the world is doing, you know, I'm already found, he already let me know that's what I've been doing. And I told you, I don't do it nearly like I used to. Well, I'm getting ready to just get off of it. I'm going to take uh, YouTube all together and take it off my phone. So there's not going to be any reason for me to be looking at it for anything. Uh, I'm not going to be responding to comments, anything, you guys. Um, God bless each and every one of you. I hope and pray that everybody out there can get over these things and start acknowledging everything that you're seeing that God has revealed to you, okay? 
God's revealing everything to us, man. Um, at this point, I could just read the word. There's nobody out there that I need to be taught from. The Father, the Holy Spirit is doing that right now. Uh, he's revealed his mighty power and everything that we're seeing. The DNA, the names of people, abomination, Trump, Pence, Biden, time. Um, the 46 years building the temple, the 46 in our DNA, um, the gates of hell will not prevail. Bill Gates behind it, behind everything. You guys, um, it just goes on and on and the world can't receive it. You have, you can tell, you know what time it is, um, God bless you guys. I hope and pray everybody out there, you guys, you can get through this. Because like I said, it's another addiction. You know? And uh, I'm not going to sit there and justify anything, my reasons behind it anymore. Um, I'm sure the scoffers will even miss me. Because uh, they, what are they going to do once I'm off of here, you know? It's done. And their goal is they want to keep people on here. They love mischief. They love division, the they love all these things, you guys, um, I would highly recommend you just get in touch with other brothers and sisters, uh, email one another, um, stop going through it, because it got to the point where I couldn't find anything and didn't like anything, and it was like getting worse and worse, and the Lord revealed it to me last night, what it was, uh, it's time to put it down. God bless you guys. I hope and pray everybody out there you stay strong in the Lord and Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. I pray you guys will uh, healings and be blessed by God in these end times. You know, those who seek him, he will guide your steps. Uh, his word says it and his word is the truth. You know, whatever you ask for in his name, you know, those that are following him, you know, the father will give it to you. But you got to, uh, this is time, you guys. Everything's getting ready to start washing away. It is washing away. You know, a lot of repos are happening. Banks are closing in China. And the world's in turmoil. Everybody's getting mad, angry, war. You know, all these things are coming. And God is doing it. Revelation seventeen seventeen. God puts it in their hearts. The word of God says that he brings your enemies against you. It's all there. Okay, don't be deceived. God bless you guys. Pay attention to what the Lord is doing. He's showing you marvelous, mighty things. The world can't receive it. You can. Many were called, but few were chosen. God bless you in Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior.